Hi, my name is Laura Durigi, and I'd like to welcome you to Lehman College Art Gallery. For the next coming weeks, I will focus on a few of our exhibitions and mainly the highlights from each. Today, we begin with the first ever exhibition I worked on at Lehman College Art Gallery as a curatorial assistant, Bedazzled. You'll see works that go beyond our senses and our reason. You'll see work that have glitz and glamour and a sense of magic and mystery in all ranges of media, but most importantly, everything you'll see is bedazzling. The first work I'd like to talk a little bit about is Nancy Bloom's Harbinger. Now, I am a huge, huge fan of Disney's Alice in Wonderland, and I feel like this work totally encompasses this idea of an upside-down, topsy-turvy world, and this beautiful color scheme of the red and the yellow, and these monstrous mushrooms that overtake the piece. It's really striking, definitely bedazzling. On the opposite end of the spectrum, we have a totally black, white, and gray monochromatic work by artist Jessica Johnson titled Smoke Signals. On the left of the diptych, we see a mushroom cloud from the atomic bomb blast, and on the right, the eruption of a volcano. These two opposite images, one being created by man's destructive power of man and flanked by the destructive power of nature, um, is made beautiful with these encrusted gems and beautiful photography. And it's really striking. The next piece we're going to talk a little bit about is titled Empire by artist James Lutchie. And now we still see the same monochrome patterning with the black, the gray, and the silver, um, but it's a totally different approach. This is a pigment poured with acrylic polymers, which control the opacity and luminosity and translucency in the work. And it's swirled in a pattern and poured on the canvas in a pattern, which creates this really hypnotic swirl. And there is no beginning and there is no end. And it's just a constant pulling of your attention into the center. And it really is reminiscent of the hypnotic uh, wheel from the twilight. Light zone. The next work I'd like to explore is Pandora by artist Susie McMurray. The name is derived from the Greek myth of Pandora, who unexpectedly unleashed evil upon humanity by opening a sealed box. Not only do I love the story behind the artwork, but I helped install the piece and it's really brilliant. The piece is comprised of these amazing clear resin bullets that are all inserted into these pre-drilled holes and the light that emanates from this box is truly intoxicating. Standing in front of it, you're just absorbed into the center and it's really truly striking. The last pieces we'll be focusing on from our bedazzled exhibition are three in a series by artist Holly Sears. Ginkgo and Willow, Marigold, and Tiara with Tears are all three from Holly Sears' Tiara series. These three pieces are exquisite in their rendering. Holly is an expert in portraiture and traditional portraiture and her styling of using oil on linen and these flowers are made into princesses of their own realm in an exquisite rendition of nature we are truly bedazzled by the world around us I'd like to thank you all for joining me as we revisited Bedazzled. Please visit our website at leamingallery.org for the full exhibition catalog.